Now, before using a chip uh, in a circuit or before placing it on the breadboard, it's essential to know about its layout. Now, uh, this dot or the notch here at the top uh, becomes the reference point. So this is the notch, this is the dot. So this becomes the reference point. So the pin next to it is the first pin. And the counting uh, in these pins uh, happens in uh, anti-clockwise direction. So the next pin is second, third, fourth, and immediately uh, we'll have five uh, as the next pin, then six, seven, and eight. So we can have a number of uh, chips where the number of pins on the either side are either you can say seven or sometimes eight. And uh, you can have a look at this uh, layout here. Uh, the number of pins on one side is eight. And again, the number of pins on the other side is uh, eight. And again, the counting happens here in the anti-clockwise direction. And uh, so whenever you are placing the chip on the uh, breadboard, so these two become the reference point and you can um, use this uh, layout for the counting. So uh, other than that, the important pins are the pins that are connected to plus VCC and the other one that's connected to the ground. So usually the pins that we are using in our experiment, uh, the last pin on the first side uh, in most of the chips that we are using in our experiment is connected to the ground. And the last pin on the other side is connected to plus VCC. But uh, most of uh, those uh, chips have only uh, seven pins on one side and seven pins on other side. So which means here uh, that ends in, with seven and here that ends with 14. But again, uh, looking at the data sheet is very essential to know about the role of each pin and to know about uh, where is the plus VCC, where we can connect the plus VCC and where we can connect the uh, exam. Now, if we have a look at this chip, uh, it has 14 pins uh, in total, which means uh, seven on uh, one side and seven on the other side. So uh, the next step is to identify the uh, dot and the notch. You can see it's on the left side, bottom left is the dot, and then we also see the notch. So when we place this on the breadboard, uh, we have to place it very carefully so when we do that uh, the pin just next to the dot is the first pin uh, and uh, and from here the counting be counting begins and uh, the last one is the seventh pin and then immediately this will be the in the anti-clockwise direction this will be the uh, eighth pin and the last pin will be the 14th pin. 